All right, so ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Mirror's Edge, and welcome to the probable conclusion. I think what we're going to do... Well, that's not what I had intended. I wanted to land on this, and then I wanted to land on something below. I obviously didn't want to just, like, go careening. Okay, see? Now, the thing we're supposed to do is a slow descent. See, now I can stop here. I probably should have rolled. Oh! Oh, there's a briefcase over here? There's a briefcase over here. How would I get that briefcase? I guess if I land on the pipe, then I can drop back. Or I can land on the truck. Okay. So where would the briefcase be? You know, it's weird because you so rarely hit ground level in this game, and a few times you do, it kind of throws you off. Here we go. You're like, wow, this is weird. <laughs> Shout out to Haseo, who just re-upped his membership for 13 months. That means Haseo has earned his Regal Crown Chat badge. Because it's now official, I have the new crown. And it looks awesome. I love those Regal Crowns. They're really a big step up from the regular crowns. Um, I know for a whole year here that I've been on YouTube, people have been using the regular crowns and like them, but... I was really anticipating you guys unlocking your new ones, and I'm very happy you are now. Finally, keep in mind, at the two-year mark, you're going to get a diamond crown. Um, there actually is a rose gold crown that I used to use in between as well, but sadly on YouTube, they don't have an in-between level. It's one year and then two years, and that's it. They don't have like a two-year, three-year deal. So we're just rolling with that unless YouTube upgrades that, which they may. We'll see. All right, so... How do we get inside? I'm assuming we are going to be doing something with this truck. Perhaps. Right? Like a running jump over. I don't know. That's pretty far. Um, maybe there's another way. I don't think I can reach. Maybe I can reach that. I'll try. I don't know about this. Ready? <clears throat> okay. Here we go. I'm going to try this. No, that's a no. There's no hole in the fence. The game is saying, go back this way. Really? Oh, wait. What the? Oh, my goodness. When has the game done anything like that? Never. Oh, I'm remembering this. You get smuggled in in the truck. That's what right. And you come out of the truck and you're anyway? inside. That's right. No idea. Could be munitions, I guess. Might be to do with this project. Give me guts. Look, head straight for the deck if that's where you saw this guy. Once you found your killer, get some answers and get out fast. Lots of blue traffic in the area, so get ready for a fight. So I remember, I think you, you smuggle yourself into the warehouse this way. You do a lot of stuff. I think there's some fighting in this one, too. It sucks to the fighting is the, the weak point in the game. And I think this is where the glitch... I'm pretty sure this is where the legendary glitch happens, where I infinitely fall. And the physics never work right, so I never hit the ground. You just infinitely fall forever. I'm almost positive this is it. Okay. The good, wow, my controller's vibrating right now, by the way. So obviously the truck is moving. You hear stuff. See, they're going inside. John R. Uh, has done a super chance. Let's have a great stream. Thank you, John. Oops. I'm trying to do this with one hand. Thank you, John. I'm going to do my best to have a great stream. Okay, now how do we get out? There it is. Oh, shit. That was a bad move. Oh, fuck. Slide. Oh, I'm doing the wrong. How do we slide? I forgot. Ah, oh, shit. It's the wrong... I was hitting the wrong button. That really sucks. I'm pretty damage now. Yeah. I was hitting all uh, right. Right trigger instead of left trigger. I forgot that the slide is left trigger. So we're going to go up. All right. Let's try. Wah! Look go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh, shit. Uh, go. Nice. Apparently there's a case around here. How the fuck do I get to the case? Where would the case be? Uh, 
I don't see a case, and I'm not dropping down the F. Fuck that. But down there, that's a case I'm not touching. Oh, let's go this way. I didn't see a case, but uh, whatever. What are you doing? She got stuck. This way they want me to go. Okay. I'm stuck. Why am I not moving? I'm stuck again. Why do you need stuck? Okay, here we are. Hurry up! I'm gonna die. Now, how was I supposed to know she was gonna do the slowest possible handle turn I've ever seen in my life? <laughs> It was ridiculously slow. I guess maybe I have to take that guy out. Oh, this is impossible. How am I gonna fight those two? There's no way. Hmm. They already know where you are. That's crazy. How the hell do they already know? You die. Wow. How do I do this? I don't know how to do this. I don't remember how to do this. It seems like I have to disable the guys. The crazy part is they already psychically know where you are and start shooting at you before you're even, like, exposed. Okay, I got one. I'm get my health back. Oh, never mind. I need to kill one and then get to the other, I think. She's gonna get stuck. She gets stuck in a ladder. It's so weird. Oh my, there's three? I thought there was one or two. There's three. I don't know how I'm taking out fucking three. This is out of control now. There's one, but I don't want to use this. I, I don't want to use the guns. I'm trying to get the achievement to not use any guns. It's like impossible to do it without the slow-mo. With the slow-mo, you can always disarm it. It's like impossible to do it without slow-mo. There's a, yeah, there's a no-gun achievement. I think it's like 80 gamer points. a crazy amount of gamer points to do it. She can't, see, she can't do it without the slow-mo. It just doesn't work. That is so dumb. And of course, I have no recollection how I did this in my original run. I, who knows? It still didn't fucking work! <laughs> her hand was on it! You see how her hand was on the gun? It doesn't work. Oh my god. I pressed the fucking Y button. Why? It doesn't... What the fuck? It worked before. Now it doesn't work. <laughs> you got, what you guys don't understand is this game is not responsive like you're thinking. You think, oh, it's like perfect. You press it. No. It, it's kind of like a wonky. You don't feel like you're underwater when you're playing it. That's kind of how they designed it. Here you go. That's kind of how they designed it. So it's not perfect controls or anything like you're thinking. You just got to kind of like mash around to get the counter. 
I didn't want to fire. Are you shitting me? Now they're going to say, oh, you shot a guy. See? Now they're going to say, oh, you shot a guy. And now I don't get the achievement. I hope not. Because I didn't mean to do that. I don't know. How do you drop a weapon? Once you counter a guy, how do you drop it? Why? Okay. He swung before I was even near him. He's swinging. As soon as it blinks red, I press it. I get hit anyway. You have to press it like early to get it to catch. Like I said, it's 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 laggy and not responsive control when it comes to the combat. The combat by far is the worst part of the game. Right. If only I could skip them, but I can't. I have to open that slow door, so I have to take out these guys or else they're going to kill me. I'm going to show you my health. Thing. down. What the fuck? He didn't even shoot me. <laughs> he never even shot me. Okay. Just die. Yes, we played getting over. Yes, we have. What hit me? What the fuck? I'm well aware how stupid this looks. This is how you have to play it. is the gameplay of the game. There we go. Okay, one left. There we go. Okay, I did it. One of the hardest combat segments of the game right there, for sure. Very nice. Okay. One of the big idiots just ban that guy and kill you on. You need to find a way yeah. off those car decks, babe. There we go. Ooh. Yes, I should be past this. Should be this way. No, yes. Why can't I? Oh, here we go. Nope. Oh, I love the colors in this game. I really do. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. I'm thinking, grab this and then shimmy left. And then maybe jump and swing. Let's see. Oh, no, I'm not going to learn any sliding glitch. <laughs> Someone says, oh, there's a sliding activation glitch where you could slide and open doors. I'm just going to play the game like it's intended. I'm going to try to learn glitches. Try and find a way off that level before reinforcements show up. Oh my god, she jumps and, and misses. I love it. 
It's right fucking there. I can't make you actually move towards the the way. You know what I mean? Like, this is a major part uh, a problem with, in my opinion, first person games, is in real life. You can obviously move in position in midair. In these games, you can't. You jump just like, well, you're at the mercy of the game to decide if it's going to go towards your objective or just flop and fall. Not there yet. Jade is very happy. Would be very happy for me to play on Chardis. He loves it. So let's see. I'm gonna swing and grab this one. I think. Yes. Now from here, I'm gonna probably grab this one to my right. Yep. And now from here, I do a swing over there. There we go. Let's get the height. Jump. Nice. Okay. Now, this looks tricky. In fact, oh no, is this it? This might be the infamous room. This is the room where I think I got the infinite fall glitch. At least it kind of looks like it. I think it is. Yeah, see, there's ledges up there you gotta grab and... Shimmy all little around. Little activity on that boat, but he seen what he thinks is your guy on the top deck. Okay, this. I think we go left. Okay, now from here, up there. Here. Oh, nice. This is... Now, this might... Oh, this is the room, I think. But I think I'm... Yeah. Because I think what you have to do... I'm trying to remember. We're not done. Yeah, you gotta get real high in this room. So, if I remember, this involves, like, a crazy wall-running jump. Yeah, it's like a crazy wall-run jump to grab the edge but man do I not remember how to do it I'm trying to look devil you cannot grab pipes that's not possible so that's a no go there's nothing to grab and shimmy there right if you need to grab that that's how you get out is up there so how the hell do I get the momentum that I need damn it's kind of like if I remember it's a multiple wall run puzzle. Like you jump in wall run here. Oh God, it's glitching. It's glitching right now. <laughs> you have to like jump in wall run, but then you have to run over there. It's like a double wall run, if I'm remembering correctly. Yeah, I remember this being really tough. Cause I think you have to run over there and then jump and wall run again and then jump and grab the ledge. I don't know, man. Oh, see, that was almost it. That was almost it. You had to wall run, then wall run, then grab. It's a three-part jump, if I remember correctly. There, there it is right there. See it? Ah, oh, tried and fell. Oh, that was it. That was it. She was right there. She was right there and missed. Drake says he's got a runner in your area. Says they reported a lot got of it. Nice. Why wow, did it quick? Oh, good shit. On the top deck. I remember that ju that jump taking me a long time in my first playthrough. <sighs> so that's cool that I did it so quick. Very nice. Very good. Very good. Jim DeFrog says, I don't know how Phil doesn't feel nauseous playing this. First person games don't make me nauseous. The only thing that ever made me nauseous in first person was VR. But these games don't bother me at all. I'm almost positive that's the room where the glitch was in my first playthrough, the infinite fall glitch. Should be a way through to the top deck above you, near car deck six. I see if there's anything down here, but there's not. I thought maybe there'd be a briefcase or something, but no. I already missed one up in the, the garage, and they were all shooting at me. It said there was one there, but I don't know where, how I would have, uh, what the hell? I don't know how I would have, uh, gotten it. I didn't see it anywhere. Over 
over there. We are nice, nice jump. Oh, oh, cool. It all just opened. Very nice. Oh yeah? Finals is the reason there's a, that dot in the center is because it's supposed to fix nausea. It's like a fixed point for you to stare at. Oh yeah? Hmm. Am I getting Cyber Elite 5? It's free on Game Pass, so it makes it no, it's a no-brainer that I'll at least try it. Oh, fuck. Snipers already? That's very bad. I'm already dead. That was fast. <laughs> like, instant death to the fucking sniper. Okay. gonna take a while. <laughs> he shot me. He's they shooting me through cover. Him. Time to get some answers. How can I possibly stay in cover? He's shooting, he's shooting barrels, I think. He's shooting barrels around me. What a dick. No, I have no, no desire to try PSVR 2 at all. I don't ever want to do VR ever again. Stay low, Faith. Hit me if you can't see me. Good shit. How do I get to him? You're saying over there. Okay, that's fine. I just had to take those hits. There was nothing I could do about it. But I'm fine now. Okay. Whew. It's an interesting segment. Phil Smelly Ass to me a dollar fifty. Says, you going to play Uncharted 2? Or you consider replaying Infamous 1 or Witcher 3? There's no way to replay those. Uncharted 2 has a... Well, wait, hold on. Let's try this again. Uncharted 2 has a collection on PlayStation 4 that can be played on PS5. I own the collection digitally. I can play it whenever I want. Uncharted or Infamous 1 was never re-released for any modern console. Uh, Witcher 3 has a PS4 version I can play on PS5, but they're supposed to come up with a new version of Witcher 3 uh, later this year that's better and has a new DLC. Obviously, it's a no-brainer if I'm going to replay it. That's what I'll play, but I'm not doing any lengthy RPGs until I'm done with Skyrim. Benson, I'm not sure what you mean. I No, I probably didn't see your recommendation. I'm, I'm focusing right here on this segment of the game, which is quite challenging. I'm trying to see where I can drop down here. Oh my god, you fucking piece of shit. Looks like I have to jump, jump down and roll and then try to get to cover. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Okay, ready? Cover. I'm in cover. Stop, though. They told me to go there. Scaffolding over there. Oh god, this is bad. Gotta get across. Ready? Go, 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 go. To the door, to the room. Okay. Phew. Good shit. We're almost to this sniper asshole. What's over here? Absolutely fucking nothing. Whoa, whoa, whoa.
What the fuck? I died instantly. You fucking dumb shit. At least there's a good check. Again, gotta say, there's great checkpoint system, right? Great checkpoint system in this game. Thank God. Because if there wasn't, I'd be pissed. Jesus fuck, how many times do I have to hit her? Oh my god! Jesus, she won't die! How do I beat her? I don't remember how to do this. Now I'm dead. I hit her a million times. It's so fucking stupid. It's obvious this is another puzzle boss. You know how to do it exactly. Here we go. Punch her in a cunt. <laughs> Ooh, cunty punch. Because huh. you can't counter what she's doing. There's no, there's no dodge in the game. There's no dodge, there's only disarm, and you can't counter those moves. <laughs> the combat is so bad. The combat is so bad in this fucking game, man. Oh. See how the gun's going pink now? So I think when the gun's pink, you can take it. There it is! I got it. I think that's it. Yes, that's what you're supposed to do. He's getting away. Not a he, it's a she, obviously. Where? The fuck? Where'd she go? What the? Look at it. This is the objective right now. The objective just flipped me completely. This way. Okay, I got my checkpoint. So once the gun glowed pink, that's when you were supposed to know to try to disarm. Okay. Chase is on. Can you skip that fight? Yes, if you defeat two other shard bearers before the end of the game, you can actually completely bypass this fight. Go straight to the capital city. It's freaking pretty cool how the open world works in this game. Oh shit. Run it. You're kidding! She freaking hit the column. Like, I was supposed to be able to tell where the column was. 
Oh my god, now she won't jump. Look at this. <laughs> uh, terrible. Bullshit. What did I do wrong? There's a fucking column in my way. I'm supposed to know that there's going to be a column in the way and you can't jump at that specific spot. How dumb. Jump! She fucking didn't grab it again. Oh my god, here we go again. Okay. Go. Shit, I went the wrong direction. Zip line. Nice. The chase. The four four chase continues. Careful, Dave. Same deal, I guess. You can like a disarm. I can't dodge the kicks. There's no way to dodge them. Oh my god, it's so bad. She knocked me off and shot me. Fucking bullshit. Oh. Careful, Dave. Terrible. I don't even know what that fucking super chat means, but you know it's something insulting, so I'm just gonna ban him. I have no idea what it means, though. <laughs> okay. Careful, Why is everything hitting me? This is the most effective way to beat it, by the way. Just do jump kicks and tell it goes. There you go. There you go, disarm. Got it. Okay, chapter complete. Woo! To warn you off. Oh, I'm sorry. One of her own Call runners. Go, Faith. You remember what you did with your family? The runners are screwed. Icarus is just the start. And I want to live, Faith, not just survive. Why, Pope? His campaign was getting unexpected support, but he got stupid. Started making threats to the wrong people, high up people. He found out about Icarus. So they had you kill him. Him or me. Sorry about Kate. Didn't know she was your sis. Boy, they're terrible shots. That's like a whole lineup of people shooting all over the place and missing. <laughs> they're terrible. 
They're worse than stormtroopers. Thank oh, you to nice Anonymous, thing. who okay. just did a two dollar tip and said, "Shout out to the Heard soundtrack." I know. Kiddo. Listen, Krieg says Kate's just been tried. Already. Wonders of the Swift Justice Program, huh? They found her guilty, Faith. Of course. Of course they did. Convoy's taken her off to jail in less than an hour. Thank you to the anonymous tipper for the two dollar tip. Drake's I appreciate that. Drake's organizing a rifle drop near the new CCC building. I'll keep you posted. All right, so I believe this going. is the next to last chapter we're starting right now. Thank you guys for everything tonight. If you are enjoying tonight's stream, please give it a like. We're currently at like. 40 some likes i'd like to get 100 by the end of the stream as always and of course everyone watching on demand on youtube please consider liking the video leaving a comment or supporting in any way you can whether that be becoming a member uh maybe a super thanks that'd be awesome in fact a little crow gaming just did a super chat and says anyone getting ghost in the shell vibes for the cutscenes? um yeah i think that actually is part of what they were going for this this futuristic society that seems perfect but it's really not because everyone they're you know your lives are under control by corporations and stuff So thinking of a little crow X gaming, I'm gonna put an extra X in there. <clears throat> All right. Did I enjoy the sequel? No. The sequel to this is terrible. Mirror's Edge Catalyst is a horrible game. They took this formula and turned it into an open world, really boring, repetitive, garbage style game. They were trying to emulate every other game that had open world content and failed miserably. It was super boring. And the main plot stunk too. The only thing that was fun is that there were these parkour indoor challenges that were meant as like legacy stuff from the previous game. Like, what the hell? I don't know what happened. There. They had these indoor like challenge rooms. We had to do puzzles and stuff. And those were fun because they kind of felt like classic Mirror's Edge. Everything else in the game stunk to high heaven. It was really bad. I couldn't believe how badly made it was. Like, they totally missed the mark of what made their original game good in that one. Fuck you guys. Can't catch me. Mark says this is the first dice developed game he actually had ever played before he had played Battlefield for the first time. Have a good night, Kagome. Sounds good. Proof chat wrong and blow a bubble. If we get 100 likes, I'll blow a bubble. How about that? And how about this? If we get $50 in tips, I'll put on gunner glasses. If we raise $100 in tips, I'll put on a hat. And $150, i will put on a vest. <laughs> Totally different from my normal setup. Something special for you guys tonight. We're gonna have to relocate that drop. I'll get on the creek. See if you can lose it. Ah! I tried to do the roll. For some random reason, it doesn't work half the time. So how do I get over this? Right here. I press jump. Nothing happened. Great. This way. Jump did not work. The jump didn't work. Great. Where am I? Wait, wait, where am I now? This is weird. I think they teleported me forward. I really think they did. Because I don't remember being here. <laughs> Krieg's going to drop the rifle inside the CCC building. It's around the corner. Should give you a good view of Gage Conway. <laughs> Here we go. Nice. Yeah. 
No, I didn't want to do the double jump. Oh my god. Why would I want to do a second jump? I totally didn't want the second jump. Ugh. I did not want the second jump. That's what I wanted. Now. Yeah, I think we have to try to make it to that. Okay. We did it. Cool. Alright. So convenient, we have all these elevators, huh? Cause there was this, can you imagine doing time trials in this game with the current game console? You mean like it was like fully updated graphics in this? It would be pretty neat, I think. Buttery smooth silk 60 frames and everything. Alright, now oh man. How in the hell do I get it was like you gotta climb all the way up. Oh boy. How are we gonna pull this off? Right? Looks like there's so much shit here. Who knows what we're supposed to be climbing. above. Hmm. No, I don't think I can grab anything. That looks way too high. <gasps> Best you can do is stand on that. No, this can't be. They want me to go way up there, so there's gotta be another way around. This can't be it. There's gotta be maybe on the other side so to, to systematically get up there slowly. Look over here. It's probably a, a, a pretty. Oh, wait a minute. Look. Okay, a hidden. Here, a hidden uh case. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. Try this again. Oh. There we go. There's the hidden case. So we got that. Grab it. Okay. Ah! Ran out of fingers! I think that's get a certain amount of the cases, and in my original playthrough, I wasn't really trying at all for the cases. So, cool. <laughs> I'm getting actual achievements, extra achievements playing this game from the first time I played it. Pretty cool. All these years later. Okay, this looks like we're onto something right here. Looks like if I can get there and we can use that scaffolding to pop scaffolding excuse me to possibly get higher up okay aha look at this takes you all the way across and then grab that i don't know why she was falling can you hmm. damn it because it looks like you can wall run here but it doesn't take you anywhere unless that is that a lift you can use? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't know. It didn't really do anything. <laughs> We've been over here, but this doesn't go anywhere. Uh... <clears throat> Game is not giving you any easy indication of what you need to do here to climb up. Might be one of the cases where kind of left your own devices to figure out the basic of what they want you to do. Well, that didn't look right, but I did it. So now... Okay, I've been here already, but it didn't seem like you could go any further up from here. There is a higher up platform right there. Nothing to jump off of to reach it. Huh. It's above me. If I can reach that platform above me, maybe that's how you get up, but there's like nothing here to grab. This is tricky. 
Guys, you gotta realize that if you keep asking me random questions when I'm trying to play a game like this, you're not gonna get them answered. I'm in the middle of trying to figure out a tough puzzle. I'm not gonna sit here and just answer a cacophony of unrelated questions when I'm trying to figure out how to play the game. I'm not trying to be a dick. I'm just saying, like, you guys are, like, bombarding the chat with random-ass questions that have nothing to do with the game. I'm not gonna be answering those right now. Uh, Jade loves the arm tattoo on, uh, on Faith. Uh, hi. Man. Jump. See, she won't... She doesn't get the momentum to jump and grab that second floor. There's gotta be a way to get momentum enough. Maybe a wall jump here, you think? Oops, bust my ass. No, you know what? I don't think you can wall jump here because it's a tarp. It's not a wall. It's a tarp. So there's... Yeah, I don't think you can actually wall jump off of that. Oh, man, this is tricky. I remember this being tricky, too, in my original run, too. Greg, I'm gra glad to hear you're enjoying this dream. Hmm. I do feel like I was on the right track there, but I feel like I need to get higher up, and Amanda, I do not know how to get higher up there. and man, I don't know. So you can wall jump off the metal. You cannot wall jump off the yellow tarps. Those are not going to let you wall jump. So I can't wall jump off. I can wall jump off of this, but there's nothing to grab. So that's a waste. There's nothing I can do there. And then again, wall jump there will lead me to nowhere I doubt well maybe I I don't know I don't think so what the I could climb that now that did not look like that was climbable uh doesn't really oh wait oh my god okay holy shit it was climbable the whole time I didn't even realize that all right well that helps now I go over here with a wall run yep okay ready nice all right we're on to something here good shit Well, not really. How can I get higher up? There's a scaffolding right there. See, they want me to go way high up. This door's not gonna open. There's gotta be another platform somewhere. They must want me to cross over here. They must, yep, okay. And then probably over to there. Let's just double check. Aha! We've got to get... Okay, I have to jump off that platform and get to the next level. I see it. Cool. Shout out to an anonymous dollar for the tiver saying 2008 was an amazing year for game releases. This GTA 4, Call of Duty, World at War, Fallout 3, and I played them all. That was the year that I got back heavily into gaming. Actually, it started in 2007. But 2008 was the year when I was buying, like, all the major new releases and really enjoying them. Uh, Jade, I do not know the story on the arm tattoo. I don't understand. I think there might be lore behind it, but I'm, I'm not up on the lore to answer that question for you, sadly. Okay, ready? Nice. Cool. We're getting somewhere. So, now there's one here. Nice. This is very good. Very good. Now. Oh, right here. Wall jump. Nice. Very good. We're getting good progress. All right. Let's see what's next. Possibly. Yes. I was just going to say possibly this here. Yep. We're going to wall jump onto it. And then we're going to do balance beam. What the fucking shit? She walked off by herself. Are you shitting me? <laughs> Why would she do that? She literally walked off by herself. Thank God the checkpoint system. Again, 100% praise for the checkpoint system of the game. She did it again. The game is, is doing too much momentum with the wall jump. Because I'm not even touching the thumbstick anymore. There we go. So I didn't touch the thumbstick and then she grabbed rather than walked forward. Okay. Good stuff. Alright. 
man, do not play this game if you're afraid of heights. You will fucking do liquid shits everywhere. So they want me to go up? Okay. I think... Right there, there's a ledge directly in front of me. See that? I don't know if I can reach it from here. I almost feel like... I need to go there, and then... No, I think I do need to do a running jump here. Ready? No, what are you doing? She's falling. Stop falling. Okay, ready? She fell! Oh! Fuck. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> let's try again. Jump! Made it. That's what I wanted to do the first time. Okay, cool. Now. Aha. She, she messed up. She did. She didn't do the jump I told her. Great. I gotta do this again. Okay, where am I? Where am I? I fell? How far did I fall? Where the hell am I? What the? I don't even know where I am right now. Oh, shit. I fell to some area. I'm stuck. Oh my god, I fell all the way back down? Oh, fuck this. Get me back to the checkpoint. Okay. She fell down to an area I'd already passed. I'm not doing that again. Okay. Alright, let's just jump again. And she doesn't do it, and she falls. Echo of Eons sent me a dollar for this. The present is a matter of perspective. Thank you, Echo of Eons, for the tip. I'm sure that's correct by some crazy... My keyboard doesn't want to work. Um, I'm sure that's correct by some uh, perspective. Whether it's mathematical, whether it's hypothetical, whether it's psychological, whether it's uh, astronomical, astrophysical, whatever. Dal, do the jump. Why won't you jump when I tell you? No, what are you doing, Dal? <laughs> come on, come on, man. You want to jump? I know you do. Come on now. No faith, you stupid idiot. <laughs> uh. Thank you to Jason for the uh, super chat. He says I mentioned in, I mentioned contributing way too much. That's great. Thanks for the opinion. I haven't even mentioned it in a long time. So thank you for uh, your opinion. And that is your opinion. And you are entitled to it. It could be wrong. It's fine. But you're still entitled to it. I'm not going to tell you not to have that opinion. Here I am playing the game, minding my own business, and not talking about anything like that. And you complain about it. So sounds to me like maybe you're thinking about it a little bit too much, right? <clears throat> you ready? Look at your own feet. She doesn't grab it. Why wouldn't she grab it? If the platform's literally in front of her and she won't grab the platform that's directly there and I've already made that jump. <sighs> there, see? <sighs> okay. So, what was I doing? I was thinking wall jump, right? Was I thinking wall jump or something? How did I... Oh, here we go. This was the wall jump I was trying to do, and I whiffed. Okay. Nice. Okay, we're here. Now, we platform here. I don't want to. No, I don't want to wall jump there. That's not gonna help. There gotta be something up here to do. Let's look around. They want me to go. Oh, just a little bit higher, like one or two more floors. Okay, I got a wall. I got a wall jump across. Yep. Absolutely, okay. And now we got a platform here. Likely what they want. And then here, see that? So nice. Very nice. Now. Uh, oh, okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Nice. Oh, you <laughs> Why would she do that? Why? Why? Come on. 
What are you doing? Come on. Let's try this again. Ready? Jump. Land. Thank you. She actually actually grabbed it. I mean, I can't make her grab. That's the game mechanic that has to work. And sometimes if it doesn't work, you're, you're screwed. All right, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. I guess we're going to wall jump again. Yep. Oh, or we're going to grab the ledge. Maybe I can wall run. Yeah. That's it. Nice. Very nice. This room is, is probably the coolest room so far, only because you're finally starting to get, get the hang of all the parkour and you're realizing the amazing amount of stuff you can do with it. Jump! It dropped my jump! Are you shitting me? I can't even do anything now. Look at this. Now where was I? I was here. Try jumping this time, like I tell you, when I press the button, see? You need some kind of vent near you? Quick route to the sniper position. Here's the vent. So what a room. And again, this showcases all the parkour aspects of the game in one room, basically. All your abilities and everything in one, you know? It's pretty pretty neat the way the room is done, because at first you're like, nah, I can't possibly do this. And you start to realize, oh, I can do this little thing, I can do this little thing. It's actually one of the best parts of the game, that one room. I'm glad. Gun says he's liking all the little uh, improvements and changes I'm doing to the YouTube stuff, and it feels better than when I was on Twitch. And I agree with you. Ow. Okay. Oh. Briefcase? Briefcase. Two of three. I'm probably not going to find a third. If you get a third, you get an achievement for that. Kevin, this is the regular Mirror's Edge, the original, not the new one. Fuck the new one. I, think it's, I say new, it's like six years old. That thing's a piece of dog shit. This is the good one. This is the good shit. We have to do this. They're forcing us to. Looking good. I can't. Is clear. They won't let me pick it up. I don't know. Oh, there it is. What's going on? There's the convoy. Right thumbstick toggle to zoom. It doesn't work. Look. It doesn't do anything. What am I doing? I don't understand what I'm doing. I'm gonna fail this. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Where'd the gun go? I dropped it? When did I drop it? Shit! Shit, I missed it. I missed it, Mark. She dropped the rifle. Why? You see the rifle? Get to it and get that convoy in your sights. Find a way of slowing it down. Try going for the engine. I'm gonna patch you into the CPF channel the convoy's using. That was weird. Connors, convoy. What's your status? Over. Looking good. Route is clear. Oh my god, well. <laughs> With my controller batteries low, I guess this is a good opportunity to split the part. Alright. 